Welcome back to another video, you guys. It's your boy Tony. I am reporting, freshly cut up, and we got some beautiful California weather. So it's an amazing, blessed day. I'm curious to know what you guys prefer, race or show. So like the 350Z would be race, and then the Homie G35 would be show. So I want to know what you guys think. Let me sure leave it in the comments below. We got something very exciting today. We're gonna be working on the Blue G35 today. I got some spanner wrenches. We're gonna go adjust some stuff, and I'll show you guys something cool. So just pick it up when we get there. Just press them out, just press them out. Yes, sir. Oh. Oh, yes, sir. Check out the tire and put a new tire. Tony, you're the guy with the new tire. Mm -hmm. Homie's running on double turbos, double spoons. <laughs> <laughs> So, I'm just gonna slam it, like, I'm gonna, you know? Yeah, do what, Cause <laughs> do what you gotta do. Because, like, there's, like, not that much room. It's probably gonna drop, like, half an inch. But that's, like, the max. Unless you wanna do, like, what everybody else does, like, the, like, everybody else that runs it, they just take off the collars. Yeah, it's a full inch drop. And nothing happens, it's not having a schedule. Well, I don't know how much these <laughs> like you tell me you're not you don't scrape so we no, might I be cool it, you, you them, bro. <laughs> 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 well we can slam it like well I don't know no, I'm, no, I'm no, a, let's just do it half an inch I'm sure homies, yeah well because if if you if you're gonna be pushing it a little bit it's gonna squat you feel me yeah let's half an inch So I know how to do it, you know. Okay. <laughs> and then now we can just adjust them with, with like, you know, easy. Seems cool. That could have gone very bad, very quick, but it's cool. You know, nothing bad happened. No one got hurt. You good, you good, you Your car looks like mine, but reversed. Like my front tires are all meaty, and like my rears look all uh, look like that. You feel me? Oh, ball into it. No, like uh, the sidewalk and thing. Like you know, yeah. like fucking local oh, house. Yeah. I like the way this looks. Be there for you. Perfect. So my camera took a poop. We're currently trying to diagnose it. I'm literally out here recording with my phone. Fix the height, and I'm currently recording on my phone. It's a Samsung S9, so it's it's not that bad. But we lowered it. I don't know how much the other camera was able to record, but we dropped it about like it was like two quarters of an inch from lip to rim. So we dropped it a little bit. Um, we already did the rears, so we'll, we'll show that right now. But I'm actually gonna lower it now on some plywood because now it's a little bit too low. So we're gonna lower it with the quicks. See what's up. Let me try to get this angle for y'all. Oh, God, dear God, that's tucking. And then the and the jack's stuck. <laughs> Three hours later. All right, there we go, there we go. All 
Yeah, that's that's pretty tucked, my boy. I'm not gonna lie. Nah, you're cool. At least we rolled the fenders front and we already, so we didn't have to worry about that. The homie trying to fix the camera. Sad boys. Jeez, that is tucked, my man. That is tucked. That thing is tucked. Here, trying to make a vlog happen. So, whatever happens, we always gotta work around it. Jeez. Right, this, this is pretty much how it sits. It's, it's some pretty cherry, right? I, I know it was gonna rub, but I'm a little skeptical. You feel me? It's not that low in the rear, but it's gonna squat. So I don't know. I don't know how much it's gonna feel, how much different it's gonna feel, but I don't know. You you want to see if it rubs? Are you trying huh? to you trying to turn the steering wheel to see if it rubs? Yeah. The angle on my phone is like so small, like you can't literally see anything. And like I have to get I have to get pretty far back for you guys to see the car. Go to the other side. Go to the other side. Okay, it's crazy. It don't run. Nah, you're cool. You're cool. Look at that thing turn. Jeez. It actually sounds good now, huh? Yeah. It starts with a starts like yeah. with a idle, yeah. Yeah, yeah. It doesn't sound like it doesn't sound camped. <laughs> That fresh new motor? Listen to her purr. Still a DE though, but at least it's a workable DE now. Jeez! You know the vibes. It sounds so good now, it's like it doesn't sound like I don't know, like it sounds clean, you know? Like nice and clean. Cause I, I remember before it would like it would like stutter. You feel me? I don't know. Yeah, it wants to shut off. Yeah, but that sounds cherry though. And it doesn't smell bad no more. <laughs> before it used to smell all nasty. That was, my, that was good. What I hated, bro. Like, yeah. Every time I turned it on, big old blue, blue cloud of fucking. Yeah. Blue. Nah, but it's clean though. It's clean. It looks good though. Like it looks pretty good. This car always looks good though. You already know the homie drove the bug today. That's men dope. Hey, you're about to pop the tires like Hyro Pop Vine, if you know, you know. We're gonna go on a little cruise, test out the fitment. And because I haven't driven in this car in a while, so. Let's get it. It sounds so good now, though. Like the sound. It sounds like a real VQ. <laughs> You saw the, you heard the hands, you heard the hands. Yeah, it feels clean, bro, it feels cool. What does it like, it, uh, you know, like, I don't know. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. That's right, though. that's right. That new motor? Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah, that's right. Nice. Back at the crib, my camera stopped working, had a, like, error shutter thing, like, we're still trying to work out right now. Um, phone died, so I figured I didn't want to end the video just like that. So, want to do some 350Z stuff? I'm gonna throw it in there just for you guys. I actually 
if you guys know these cardboard cars come with like normally three brake lights the only ones over there but i took it off Let's see if i can show you guys yeah the car's all gutted and stripped and i took it off it usually goes right there because i took off all the stuff that goes right here so something i got so that people can actually see me is i got these brake strobe lights come on box it to you i got these brake strobe lights they're like i don't know like 10 bucks basically it's supposed to help it brake brake lights flash and like do some like it's a module pretty much it's going to change the way it turns on and turns off I pretty much showed you guys what it looks like before. So now we're just gonna take off the tail lights, and to take them off is pretty easy. To take them off is pretty easy. It's just three bolts, three tens, and then pull it out, and the harness comes off, and then we start cutting up the harness to slap this on. I really miss driving this car, but my tag should get here Monday. It's currently Thursday, so hopefully by then it'll be cherry. Right, so when you cop these, they're supposed to have like the in and out. So obviously the signal is going to the tail light, so we're gonna interrupt it so the out's gonna go towards the tail light. And all, uh, can you see that? One of them's red green, which is obviously the red one, and one of them is just black. The other one's green, yellow, so we don't need that one. It's just the black one. Yeah, everything's pretty straightforward, you know. I I taught Tony everything he knows. Uh, so we're gonna put them together, you know. Mm -hmm. Oh, crazy. All right, guys, so apparently the it has a little label. It has in and out. Can you see? So the in, we, we just just remember it as this. The in is is practically out, you know? We're, we're putting what? it to the light. <laughs> what? The in is practically out? What is this man saying? Because I'm going I'm to put it to the light. It's, it's over there. And then the out is going to be right here. I had a conversation with one of my buddies uh, not so long ago. And he told me that's how it goes. Well, this is already done. They're all pretty much ready. I just need to yeah, I did those. get did these those. ready. The homie's still struggling out here. No, I did those. You I know did the vibe. I did that time. You all saw me. Oh, come on. Anyways, these are going to get done. I have some shrink wrap right here. Around here somewhere. Right here. Some shrink wrap. We're going to use that after we're done. And then we're pretty much done. After that, I'm almost done. Just need to slap this on. So the out goes to the light. Obviously match up red with red and then black with black. And then these go to the actual harness over here. In goes right here. So out goes this way, in goes this way. Alright, so I got two, both of them connected from one side. And I actually remember to put the red. So the red one's going to go right here on top of both of them. And then we're going to shrink that on top of that. Just to be safe. And get your little lighter. Hey, so where's the, the thing? I get a cap or what? I, I don't have any more. Alright, so for this one, I'm going to use something a little bit different than it'll be like these. These are also shrink wrap, but they're... You put the cable on the inside and then you crimp it together. So the inside is a crimper and then the outside is pretty much heated. So we're going to... I have a few of these extra, extra laying around, but I didn't have enough for both sides. But since we used the other tape on the other side, I figured we use these for this side. If it don't go in easy, it's because the thing gets in the way. So I, I try to put it like right here. It'll slide out, but I try to put it like in there. And hopefully it lets everything else in. It'll just get in the way sometimes, see? No, we're not fine. Alright, we're done. Now I just step on the brake and see if it works, see? Hopefully it works. What are you supposed to do? The uh, brake lights are supposed to flash. Uh, I know how. Yeah. yeah. And it goes solid, right? Yeah. Do it again. Jeez. I can't tell this is good lighting or not, man. I, re I really hope you guys can see. Let me see the lights though. Oh. What are you doing? Why is he getting all the way inside? Ooh! <laughs> exactly what I wanted. Do it again. Ooh! <laughs> I like those. I like those. I know some of them like don't. I know some of them like just keep flashing, and I didn't want that. I wanted them to do that. You feel me? I've always wanted these. I've always wanted these. I literally always wanted these since I deleted the third brake light. Alright, this lighting last night was very shitty, but uh we got the car all situated right here. Car's all done. Tail lights are cool. I don't really move it to be honest. I haven't moved it in a while, so it's just been sitting here. 
and I do feel bad. I feel very bad. I need to drive it. But peep the fitment though. Peep that fitment. All right, I can't get over it yet. But anyways, I really desperately need to take this thing off the back roads. Those coils have been calling my name. They I just I just been slacking lately. If you guys like the strobe lights that we put on the 350Z, make sure to leave a fat thumbs up in the video. With like trying to find a new pad and all that, I haven't really had time to, I guess, you know, drive it or get my stuff situated because it's still missing plates. But my plates should get here Monday. Today is Friday, so hopefully they get here pretty soon. It's the day after yesterday, so yesterday was Thursday, today was Friday, and hopefully Monday, my mommy told me they would, they would be here. That's where I'm gonna wrap up today's video, you guys. I appreciate you guys so much for kicking it with me today, stopping by. I hope you guys have an amazing, blessed day. We have a ton of stuff coming, like, I kid you not. I know I say this probably like at the end of every video, but best believe that. When I say that, we mean it. I got stuff coming for the bug, I got stuff coming for the Z. We, the homies be making moves, like, we're only going up from here. So I really hope you guys subscribe and join us on that journey. But uh, I hope you guys have an amazing, blessed, wonderful day, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.